Hey, what's up, people? My name is Messi Pate, and welcome back to Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. And we're going into night three. Now, once let me go play with her. She's so pretty and shiny. Didn't you make her just for me? Hmm. I I like that. Now, what what the fuck was I gonna say before that little bitch ass get interrupted? Welcome me? I don't back even know. to another pivotal <sighs> night of your thriving new career, where you get to really ask yourself, "What am I doing with my life?" What would my friends say? That would and most importantly, will I ever see my family again? We understand the stresses of a new job and what? we're here for you. To help you reach a more stable and relaxing frame of mind, we offer several musical selections to of help course. make this elevator ride as relaxing and therapeutic as possible. We offer contemporary jazz, classical, rainforest ambiance, as well as a wide selection of other choices. Using the keypad below, it seems oh my you god. Alright, this is it's the gonna, it's gonna pre pick what you it were for me anyway. To type, and I will auto correct it for you. Thank you for selecting Casual Bongos. <laughs> now that your elevator experience has been customized to your needs and you're thoroughly relaxed, it's worth mentioning that due to your lackluster performance yesterday, your pay has been decreased by a substantial amount. Fuck Please you. Please enjoy the rest of your descent. We, we cut your pay, but please enjoy the rest of the fucking descent into your hellhole job. In which robotic animatronics want to kill you. But you know, hey, night three of five. What could go wrong? Fucking everything. Alright, just let me out. Give me. I love the bongos. Due to are unforeseen awesome. malfunctions from today's shows, your nightly duties will require you to perform maintenance that you may or may not be skilled enough to perform. Wow, that's great. It became necessary for technicians to attempt to disconnect Funtime Freddy's power module. However, they were unsuccessful. Yeah. Allowing them to try again would be an inefficient path forward, as we would need to allow six to eight weeks for recovery and physical therapy. You will need to reach the parts and service room on the other side of Funtime Auditorium to perform the procedure yourself. Which Let's point? check on Ballora first and make sure she's on her stage. Uh, yeah, that's still nasty. Um, what the fuck happened Great. to Ballora? It looks like everything is as it should be in Ballora Gallery. Let's check on Funtime Foxy. Are you sure about that? It's important to make sure she's on her stage before entering. Funtime Foxy, she? Well, well, she ain't there. For one thing, Great. and that makes me it think this like might be Mangle. It looks like everything is as it should be in Funtime Auditorium. Wait, what? There is no need to check on Baby tonight. Please refrain from entering unauthorized areas. Proceed directly to Funtime Auditorium. You're gonna open the one in front of me? What the fuck? Why would you open that one and then tell me to refrain from... It's a trap. But my curiosity beckons that I go through this one ahead of me. But my brain is telling me that, yo, listen to the dude. Even though he ain't never tell you much right. Can't click on anything. Ah, uh, choices, choices. Everybody got choices. Yes, no, no, yes, 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 no, no, no. Huh. All right. Um, what did he tell me to do? That I gotta go do maintenance that I've never done before? Or I could go check on... That's probably a bad idea. Although then again... I feel like I'm AMS might have to be supposed to going over that way if that sentence even made any sense at all. But we'll go to the right here and see what happens. I can't see. Unlike it. Ballora, Funtime Foxy is motion activated. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark as to not accidentally activate her. You have been provided with a flash beacon. Use it if you need to get your bearings and to ensure you don't bump into anything. However, use it as sparingly as possible. Proceed forward to reach the parts and service room. I don't... What the fuck? So, this is retarded. I can't see a damn thing. It's straight ahead of me. But, I don't know where Funtime Foxy is. And she is definitely going to get me. Um, this is ridiculous. Oh, she's gonna get me for sure. I can't even. I don't even understand. I hear stepping, but like, 
Okay, so I understand I'm supposed to go forward, right? I don't know how I'm really supposed to detect her with the exception of the space beacon or the whatever the fuck this thing is. Why that? I don't understand. Oh, okay, so I just need to go forward. But if she's in front of me, then I need to stop. Because the beacon will let me know if she's in front of me or not, but I'm just supposed to go straight forward. Okay. Okay, so every I think every time I hear footsteps or something, I should check it. If she is in front of me or not. Oh, I feel like she's going to hit me, though. Like, for real. Okay. Is she in front of me? No, she's not. I hear more. I hear more movement. Oh, shit! There she is. There she is. Don't do that. How sparingly should I be using this, though? Okay. I'm good. I hear more footsteps. I hear more movement. Okay, not in front of me. Fuck it, go, go, go for it. Oh, never mind. I, it's farther than I thought it was. It's actually pretty damn far. It is so dark. God, I can't. It's like they just pitch black the fucking screen. All right, it's good to go. I'm going. I'm just going for it. Fuck it. I'm I'm holding down the W key. Yolo. Here we go. Not in front of me. All right, let's go. Get in the door. Get in the door. Come on. <sighs> Thank you. Motion trigger. Parts and service. What the hell? Great job reaching parts and service. It seems that Funtime Freddy is out of power, which should Thank make God. your job much easier. Yeah. The release switch for the chest cavity is located on the underside of the endoskeleton jaw. To reach it, we will first need to open the face plates. You will need to press the face plate release triggers in a specific order. And it's important to be as precise and as careful as possible. Uh, Locate the small button on Freddy's face, just under his right cheek, and press it. You mean this thing right here? For clarification, please note that I'm referring to Freddy's right, not your right. You dick. Great. Now locate the button under his left cheek and press it. Awesome. Great. Now carefully locate and press the button next to Freddy's right eye. That one right there. I see it. Great. Now carefully locate and press the button just above Freddy's nose. Oh, okay. That one right there. Oh, what? Okay. Whew. Good job. The face plates should Was that now necessary? be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. What? His what? Endoskeleton jaw? The There's like a ton of things that look like buttons. Can you be more specific? Can I get a repeat question on that? Can I get a definition? Could you spell it out for me? <laughs> I feel like if I press the wrong Good fuck- Good job. The face plates should now be open. Locate and press the small button on the underside of Freddy's endoskeleton jaw. Are you talking about that? Excellent. The <sighs> chest cavity should now be open. Remove the power module from the chest cavity. Great work. Awesome. You will now be required to remove the secondary power module from the Bonnie hand puppet. Press the large Where'd it go? button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Oh, fuck me. Oh, hi. Why the fuck are you moving? Oh, hell no. Where did you go? Are you always going to peer over his fucking shoulder? Oh, God. Fuck this. Okay, is he just... Hey! Let me click you, you little shit! Don't... I'm not comfortable with this job. What did he say that I needed to... something under his bow tie? So he needs to come out far enough for me to get him, but I feel like if... If I let him come out too far, Press he's gonna- Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Yeah, that's awesome. Where the hell is he? I think he's always gonna end up coming out with that shoulder, so I need to wait. It's like the fucking... 
spring trap, uh, the plush trap thing from Five Nights at Freddy's 4. I have to wait, not put the flashlight on, on uh, long enough. I just don't know what the audible cues are for this. And Oh, hi, you little fuck. I just don't know, like, what the audible cues are for this. I hear him scuffling and... Dude, this is so creepy to staring at his fucking face right now. I feel like he could turn on at any moment. Like, Bonnie's got that secondary mo power module. Like, whoo, powered up. Let's fuck him up, Freddy. Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. This is just amazing shit right here. If he would come out... Just look at his crotch right here right now. This non-existent dick. Oh, I can look at a lot. Of Whoa, you little shit. Hey, would you just let me, please? You got the power button. Why are you fucking moving around? Oh. <laughs> oh what the fuck? Oh, I don't have to traverse Funtime Foxy's little bullshit again, do I? I don't want to find out what that looks like. Now I'm still curious about what baby shit is over there. I feel like... Oh, come on. I feel like it might be an Easter egg, but you know what? I'll leave those to the Bravehearted. I'm just doing this. I'm just trying to get this done. For this reason, it's important to keep the room dark, as to not accidentally activate her. Or, you know, just you shut her down. Ooh, shit. There she is. Mm, not doing it. Alright, I'm good. <laughs> ah, what the fuck?! What? In the- Oh my god! I didn't hear her move! And she wasn't in front of me for one thing! Oh, this is going to be a long episode, I can tell already. This is definitely more difficult than Ballora's Unlike nonsense. Ballora. <laughs> ah, fuck you! Go away! I'm not having a fun time there, fun time Foxy, go away! <sighs> I guess I do have to use it sparingly-ish, but I just want to make sure she's not, like, fucking near me. <sighs> Can I not do all this, please? Oh, I really want to check out what's going on there. How did I make it the first time I failed two more times? Alright, let's go. Come on, get in the door. Go. Yes! Alright. Freaky fun Most time, Freddy. Sure. Yeah, that's awesome. Press the large Where'd black he button go? beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Where did that little shit go? He see, this is the problem. I don't know where he is and how I. Oh, get over here. What exact? Does he go on the top? Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. Yeah, that would be nice if he would actually come out. I don't even know why the fuck he got removed. It's so stupid. Mm. Just come out from behind him, you little shit. I just don't want to fucking have to traverse Funtime Foxy's little bullshit again. I hate that part so much. It's so much easier than Ballora, because like, oh, you hear the music? Stop moving. I gotta keep moving forward, and I have no idea where fucking Foxy is. Press the large oh. black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. I would love to. The little shit would stop hiding. He won't come out from behind the little fucking thing. Why can't I just get back there and grab his ass? He's a little puppet. What is he gonna do to me? He doesn't have any fucking legs. He's attached to another man's body. I feel bad for this. Simon. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? What do I have to do here? I don't know. Well, I guess we'll find out here soon enough. I'm just gonna say fuck it. I'm going into the baby's whatever thing here. I don't care. I'm just gonna see what's going on over here because it's like I've already been scared, so fuck it. Let's just see what's going on in this direction. Motion trigger, circus gallery vent. Yay! Time to go see what's up, Baby's Avenue. The dude's gonna be pissed at me though. Seems like I'm going here. Well, let's see what's going on here. Might as well. I mean, I'm sure babies come this way, right? Right? Did you know that I was on stage once? It wasn't for very long. Only one day. What a wonderful day, though. I was in a small room with balloons and a few tables. No one sat at the tables, though. 
but children would run in and out. Some were afraid of me, others enjoyed my songs. Music was always coming from somewhere else, down a hall. I would always count the children, I'm not sure why. I was always acutely aware of how many there were in the room with me. Two, then three, then two, then three, then four, then two, then none. They usually played together in groups of two, two, three, or two three. three, two, four, none. I was covered in glitter. I smelled like birthday cake. There were two, then three, then five, then four. I don't. I can do something special. I don't Did have. You know that? How do I, I can make copy those numbers? Things. Fuck. Although I only did not I'm sure ready why. for that now. I was always acutely aware of how many there were in the room with me. Two, then three, mm -hmm. then two, then three, then four, then two, then none. They oh, usually played together in groups of two or three. I was covered in glitter. I smelled like birthday cake. There were two, then three, then five, then four. I can do something special. Did you know that? No. I can make I mean, ice you can cream. talk to me like no one else can. Although I only did it did once. Did you say ice cream? There were four, then three, then two, then one. Four, three, something two, one. happened when there was one. A little girl, standing by herself. I was no longer myself. And I stopped singing. My stomach opened, and there was ice cream. Yay, ice cream. I couldn't move, at least not until she stepped closer. There was screaming for a moment, but only for a moment. Then other children rushed in again, but they couldn't hear her over the sounds of their own excitement. I still hear her sometimes. Why did that happen? Did you kill the little girl? I don't know. Did you... I don't understand. Well then, that was weird. I got a bunch of numbers now. I, I was listening to it and I was like, oh shit. I should be... Motion trigger. Circus gallery vent. I should be jotting this down. I'm like, oh, okay, so now I've got the numbers. I don't know what to use them for. I imagine that for the like some mini games or Easter eggs or something. I've been hearing a lot about Easter eggs lately. Um, okay, so that's now blocked off. Two. Three. Let's see if maybe these masks have anything to do with it. Three, two, three, four, two, zero. Did that count? Maybe is it baby's nose? Does baby, baby's weird ass clock have anything to do with it? Oh, wait a minute, there's a keypad up here. Two, three. Oh shit, the thing turned off. Four, two, zero. I mean, that's like a conventional keypad, right? Where zero would be in the middle, right? So let's try that again. Because there was a break. Three, two, three, four, two, zero. Motherfuck. You gotta be kidding, right? It's two, three, two, three, four, two, zero. Is that. Is that not what I'm supposed to be doing at all? Oh, I'd figure maybe. Maybe. Something. Well, I tried at the minigame shit, so let's just go ahead and progress with the night as normal. I want to press this button right here because so this fucker won't pop up at me. Do I press, press it? Press the large black button beneath Bonnie's bow tie to release the power module. I'm just going to keep clicking. If he shows up in front of me, does that mean I can still click it or is that like game over right then and there? Press the large black button. I would like to press Bonnie's the large black button to release beneath the power his bow tie, module. but he's not showing up. Can I like use the outer rims of my fucking flashlight to find him? Or is that not a thing? <laughs> ah, motherfucker! God, I can't, I can't get it. I don't know how to get it. Concentration and patience are required here. I got this though. I got this. He will show himself to me. 
Whether it's in front of my face or that shoulder of Freddy's. I gotta stop saying that. That is a bad word and everybody just says, Oh, Messy Potty, you've got to stop saying bad words. Well, how about you play scary games and not swear? It's awful. It, Bonnie's not climbing onto the shoulder. I haven't even seen him once, like, you know, doing the head nod and stuff. It's kind of getting annoying. I really want to get the button. I want to get the power module. I want that power module. Oh, you were right. Oh, my God! I almost said it again. Oh. I just looked like I mean I can't believe I just thought of that like I just pressed the beacon one there oh you're there you th I think you are yeah you are you're right there I see it I see oh this the power button yes great oh job. my god you've acquired both oh. power modules this completes your tasks for the night. Please really? exit the building through Funtime Auditorium, and we'll see you back here again tomorrow. Can you shut down Foxy, please? 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 Oh, come on. If I end up getting killed and I had to do all this over again, I'm gonna be so sad. Okay, come on. Keep going. Go, 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 go. All right, I'm good. Just hopefully it's like Ballora. It's like a free ride. Although I don't think it's gonna be. Although we got this. I think he said use it sparingly. Fuck that. I'm not getting caught. Fuck that shit. You got me fucked up. I actually managed to beat it. Come on, come on. I'm just hoping it's not giving away my position doing all this fucking flashing and dashing. Oh boy, come on. I'm just so stressed right now. I don't really make much- I'm not making much good commentary right now. Much good, good, much love ho. Because I want to make it. I want to make it so bad. I want to just get this over with. I've been recording for over an hour. You don't even understand. So much of this has been- <laughs> oh, but No! No! You can't do that to me! I just got this done! I- Daddy, she can make balloons. Have what? What the fuck? Shh, be still and quiet. It says I can wiggle. You've been sleeping for quite a while. I think they noticed that you never left the building last night. The cameras were searching for you, but they couldn't find you. I have you hidden too well. I kidnapped you. Oh God, this is not good. It goes right into night four. Are you serious? Oh, come on. What's that blinking thing over there? Is that the camera? Was that an exit or something? Oh, well. Don't be afraid. I'm not going to hurt you. I am only going to keep you for a little while. Try not to wiggle, though. You're inside something that came from my old pizzeria. I don't think it was ever used. At least not the way it was meant to be used. Oh, this is getting really sinister. Too dangerous. It's just big enough for one person to fit inside. Is this spring trap? Just barely. Well. You're in the scooping room. Do you know why they call it the scooping room? It's I feel like you're going to tell me. Dummy, this is the room where they use the scooper. Right. I thought that would be obvious. Well, yeah. Isn't that a fun name for something? No. The scooper. It sounds like something you would use for ice cream or custard or sprinkles. <sighs> it sounds like something you would want at your birthday party. To ensure that you get a heaping portion of every good thing. I wonder, though, if you were a freshly opened pint of ice cream, 
how you would feel about something with that name. Thankfully, I don't think a freshly opened pint of ice cream feels anything at all. Uh... Uh-oh. It sounds like someone else is in the building. Shh. Well, that was interesting. I really want to... What's happening now? I think that the automated fix-up is happening right now. In something. Oh. Am I being moved or is it Ballora being moved? It's Ballora, because that camera thing hasn't moved. So Ballora broke down and is being moved. What am I in? I seem like I'm in a similar body like them, because it splits down the middle. This is very interesting. Oh, she stopped right in front of me. This is stupid. And she hears shit. There's something very important that I've learned how to do over time. Like kidnap do people? Do you know what that is? Kidnapping people. How to pretend. Do you ever play make-believe? Um. Pretend to be one way when you are really the other. Uh. It's very important. Ballora never learns. But I do. I'm glad you're adaptive. They think there is something wrong on the inside. The only thing that matters is knowing how to pretend. Oh my god. Oh, well, she is getting quite something happening to her. What the fuck? She can see now. She's got eyeballs. I'll open the face plates for you. Don't you that way they can find you on the cameras. Now all you have to do is wait. I'd recommend that you keep the spring locks wound up. Your breathing and your heartbeat are causing them to come loose. You don't want them to get too loose. Trust me. Oh, this is a spring trap suit. Well, Anyway, I'm going to leave that for another time because this has been one crazy episode and I'm sure we'll get back to this at uh, one point or another. But thank you so much for watching because that does it for this video. The party train stops right here. Make sure to hit that like button and like, subscribe to help the next party train and join me in the next video, guys. Hit up. And I see you That's right. Oh, what the fuck? What the fuck? I was even on the monitor. Not on the monitor. Should I be looking at him or something? Is that like... I was trying to avoid eye contact, but why are there oncoming trucks? Man, whoever wants you to do this shit or you on your own want to do this is messed up on a whole nother level. How am I still alive? Oh my god! Oh, that was still making me so well.